Welcome to our channel MCQ1. In today's topic, we will going to cover Human Heart MCQ Part 5. So let's start the video. The medical term for the inflammation of the heart muscle is myocarditis, endocarditis, pericarditis, none of these. The correct answer is option A. The medical term for the inflammation of the heart muscle is myocarditis. The medical term for a heart murmur is arrhythmia, bradycardia, tachycardia, cardiac auscultation. The correct answer is option D. The medical term for a heart murmur is a cardiac auscultation. The condition characterized by the presence of petty deposit or flakes in the coronary arteries is known as embolism, atherosclerosis, thrombosis, none of these. The correct answer is option B. The condition characterized by the presence of petty deposits or plaques in the coronary arteries is known as atherosclerosis. Which of, which of the following blood vessels bring originated blood from the lungs to the heart? Pulmonary veins, pulmonary arteries, renal artery, renal vein. The correct answer is option A. Pulmonary veins blood vessels bring originated blood from the lungs to the heart. Which of the following blood vessels carry blood from the heart to the kidneys? Pulmonary artery, pulmonary vein, renal artery, renal vein. The correct answer is option C. Renal artery blood vessels carry blood from the heart to the kidneys. The term diastolic blood pressure refers to the pressure in the arteries. During ventricular contraction, during ventricular relaxation, during arterial contraction, during arterial relaxation. The correct answer is option B. The term diastolic blood pressure refers to the pressure in the arteries during ventricular relaxation. The condition characterized by the buildup of fluid in the lungs due to the heart's inability to form, effect, to form effectively is known as congestive heart failure, pulmonary embolism, cardiac tamponade, myocardial infarction. The correct answer is option A. The condition characterized by the buildup of fluid in the lungs due to the heart's inability to pump effectively is known as congestive heart failure. The upper two chambers of heart are called left and right atrium, top and bottom atria, front and back atria, left and right ventricles. The correct answer is option A. The upper two chambers of heart are called left and right atrium. The lower two chambers of heart are called top and bot bottom ventricles, front and back ventricles, left and right ventricles, up and down ventricles. The correct answer is option C. The lower two chambers of the heart are called left and right ventricles. The term schema refers to lack of blood supply to tissues, blockage in the pulmonary artery, inflammation of the heart muscle, irregular heart beats. The correct answer is option A. The term schema refers to lack of blood supply to tissues. The blood vessel that supply oxygenated blood to the heart muscle itself are called coronary arteries, pulmonary arteries, erotic artery, vena cava. The correct answer is option A. A. 
द ब्लड विसल डेट सप्लाई ऑक्सीजनेटेड ब्लड टू द हार्ट मसल इट सेल्फ आर कॉल्ड कोरोनरी आर्टरीज द ट्रम वेंट्रिकुलर फिब्रिलेशन रिफर्स टू द करेक्ट आंसर इज ऑप्शन डी द ट्रम वेंट्रिकुलर फिब्रिलेशन रिफर्स टू चौटिक एंड इरेगुलर हार्ट बीट इन द वेंट्रिकल्स Thanks for watching subscribe MCQs1 for latest informative MCQ